what's good you guys welcome back to my channel so today is a wednesday and i'm very excited to be starting off this video because today i'm getting my hair done and i'm getting it done for a very special reason so tomorrow and saturday i have two really important events and on saturday is the really really important one because i'm going to be a panelist for the fluence africa festival and that's a very big deal for me because i'm going to get to meet you guys and anybody else who really wants to find out about the influencer space and i'm also going to be hanging out with other influencers it's going to be such a big day such a huge festival literally the whole day i'm going to be meeting so many people just an amazing experience i can already tell from all the promo and all the stuff that's been going on behind the scenes so i really want to look good i want to make sure that i look good and i made sure that i picked a really nice hairstyle for this uh coming saturday i am going to be going in with a 22 inch frontal it's going to be bone straight really beautiful really simple and it comes from miss coco hair so shout out to them i am so excited to go straight i haven't gone straight in i've been a curl girl if you if you've been like watching when i finished with the braids and my pondo season i went straight for the curls so i'm gonna be going straight you know and i'm excited for that because i haven't also gone long and straight in a minute so if you follow me on instagram and you watch my stories then you saw i was going on and on about how i'm going in in my next hairstyle i've already started brainstorming planning and this is her this is her okay the straight bust down this is her okay so yeah i'm excited for this one my inspo is very simple i want a middle part straight bust down i'm not sure if i want to do baby hairs i will say that i'm not sure i am gonna go and take you guys with me i'm gonna get it installed at a professional salon april is back you guys my girl is back and she's gonna slay me she's gonna slay me for these two events and i'm i'm hype so if you are interested in getting yourself a new bust down a new straight frontal then i will have the link to miss coco hair in the description box i'll have the link not only to the exact hair that i'm going to have on my head from the cap construction to the lace and length but i will also have the link to miss coco hair so that you can go on there shop around and see what you like from them if you are not in your bust down season if you're still in your curl phase or entering your curl phase then i will have that link for you guys so i don't want to be late what time is it my appointment is for one i'm actually not doing bad on time i should leave right now so yeah let's go and let's get slay all right you guys so then we got started and basically she was pushing back my hair to make sure that none of it got stuck in the glue i showed her what i wanted and then we cleaned off my forehead using some rubbing alcohol and the stocking cap method is what we use to basically line up the hair and we adhered that to my head using the got to be spray i find that the spray is just so much lighter and better than the gel for the stocking cap because we are doing the ball cap method you know so after that we just dried off the glue and when the glue was dry we cut off the excess basically this excess stocking cap and made sure that none of that was going to go into the lace and then she fitted on the wig first on my head just to line it up and make sure that we were cutting the ear tabs in the right place the 
plucking job that she did was exceptional she said that the lace was really soft and it was easy to pluck and that is a big thing because sometimes the knots on a lace are just too thick sometimes they're double knotted it's not easy to pluck it's not easy to customize but she said that it was really good and i always ask her how it plucked before i install just so i can come and tell you guys and then this is us putting the glue on my head after it has adhered we put the makeup on the lace just to make sure that it blends in nicely and wherever she feels it needs a little bit more glue she will spray the got to be spray and then put the elastic band on my head and this is basically what melts the hair so then i did want a middle part so we are working on the part over here and in order to get the hair nice and flat which it was she does go in and straighten the root of the hair in the middle that really does help taking time to work in sections and really straighten the hair from the root and press down on the roots helps and you also don't need to go in with a hot comb when you do this part properly april never goes in with a hot comb which is actually like crazy i actually never noticed that she actually always uses a straight now um so yeah this is her just working on the front and i had decided to do no baby hairs because the density of this hair is a bit lower which i appreciate because like i told you guys i'm going to be wearing this hair for a few events so that means i'm going to be out and about i did not want thick full hair i wanted this to be I wanted this to be summer friendly and it definitely was you guys it looked amazing it was a great low density vibe low density always looks like relaxed hair it's so nice uh so yeah this is how it looks you guys let me know what you think i will have the link to this hair in the description box i love it it turned out fantastic i wore it all week into the weekend and it was great i have so many pictures it was such a great install i'll see you guys in my next one